it takes time to get all set up right quick you know to set this to set this podcast up for you guys right quick got a lot of topics for you guys today uh january 2nd 2020 it's the new millennium the new it, well it's already it's already the new millennium millennium the new decade and uh the new the new year and already the year is starting off pretty messy what's up y'all lockout men in the truck on the 30 for this podcast for this evening what's up how y'all feel out there today man I, I got so many I got so many topics that I'll be writing down throughout the day that I want to talk about right quick, but it's it is crazy. The drama on YouTube continues. You see what I'm saying? The drama on YouTube continues. You you guys know what I'm talking about. I'm not gonna go into detail about it because you guys already know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? I'm all I'm just saying is that YouTube Come on. Y'all not making no money on YouTube, man. Y'all not making no cheese like that, are y'all? Are y'all making cheese like that on YouTube? Let let me know. Because if y'all making cheese like that on YouTube, let me know so I can jump in on the action. You know what I'm saying? I want about two, three hundred dollars a month. You know what I'm saying? You, you know, YouTube only pays us once a month. Once a month. You feel me? And I, I, I want some of that action. I want some of that action. YouTube. Can can I get some can can I get some of that action? Hook a brother up with some of that action, you know? Uh, I don't know that phone number. I don't answer numbers I don't know. <laughs> but what's going on, y'all? Yo, this uh this this topics, you know what I'm saying? Let, let's start it off with the shocker. The shocker. Say it ain't so. Come on. Say it's not so. My girl or girls, Nick and Carla. Yo, I, I started watching them when they got into the game about a year, year and a half ago. Or was that a couple of years ago? I'm not sure. But still, shout out to Nick and Carla. I'm, I'm, I'm still reaching out to you. The hand is still reaching out to you. We want to get this. Uh, we want to get this interview going, man. I mean, you guys, look, you guys came into the game and y'all turned it around, and and it's unbelievable how inspirational, inspiring that you guys are. You know what I'm saying? You and Carla just doing the damn thing while while trucking, while living your life, while just while as as a as a couple you know what i'm saying you don't you don't see that in trucking or at least you didn't see that back in the day in trucking but see now the whole the whole field of view has changed but shocking news today nick came on her channel and and said she's leaving youtube right, so i'm actually made it to my destination uh, i'm not sure if my stuff ready yet me... but i figured i'll kind of say this in the video and i, I don't know how i look to y'all right now on my head so you're looking good girl you're looking good thoughts. um but anyways so some of y'all may be wondering like okay why am i currently watching nick and carla on their website or their right. app if my app is live right now mm -hmm. or uh or YouTube. I, I don't know where this video is at right now. All I know is I'm making this video right now. Uh, and my purpose is to try to help a lot of people kind of uh, gain a little bit more insight or a little bit more understanding of why um, we've made the decisions that we've made when it comes to the Nick and Carla uh, content. And um, it's mainly just to keep everything short, to, to gain more control over our current situation. Um, and it's understanding, like, people may not understand what's going on, why I'm doing the things that I'm doing. Some people don't like change. Some people don't like seeing, you know. 
Exactly. Change. Change is coming. And YouTube is forcing that change. Nick and Carla may not be the biggest uh, YouTubers, trucking YouTubers on, on the planet right now, but they're close. They they teetering over over 25,000 K. I mean, 25,000. 2,500 Ks. 2,500. Damn it. 25,000 subscribers. That's a lot of subscribers. And they gained that. They worked hard for that within the last couple of years that they've been on YouTube. Now, mind you, I did not start getting serious with my YouTube like maybe about a couple of years ago when I started gaining subscribers. But let, look at here and listen. YouTube is changing. You know, YouTube's changing for the worse. You know what I'm saying? I don't even know if it's going to be here next year, year at the next. But right now, YouTube is in all sorts of trouble. First, with the ad apocalypse, they had they they uh they they penalized they they penalized us creators because of uh because of a, because of a swollen few. They demonetize our content. They take some of our content down. We getting strikes for uh for stuff that we do normally. You you can't talk controversial on YouTube no more. You can't talk about you can't be yourself on YouTube, the you in YouTube. And being that YouTube is doing all this, this, this changing for the better, let them say it, you running a lot of cool content creators away. Now you guys started with this membership thing. You know what I'm saying? In order to in order to to give my my subscribers the real, the raw, and you know, I, I had to I had to give I had to give them options to pay for content. That ain't right. That ain't right. Nick and Carla is one of my favorite YouTubers. Now she's leaving, you know, to start her own platform. Make sure y'all check it out, NickandCarla.com. And they do she do have an app, and yes, it is live. You know what I'm saying? You running them away. Now, she's not, she already said that uh, she's going to, you know, like limit her uh, content on YouTube. Check it out. Dog. Better, um, you know, and I, and I think, and I'll update it, and I think this is a good move. This is, may, it may be, hey, it's 2020. I feel like it, you know, I take a step back, and I think it's very interesting how things are playing out. And when things like this happen, when bad things happen, um, my mother's husband, he actually told me, because I was having a moment where I was just, like, very frustrated with YouTube, and he got on the phone with me, and he was like, you know, when shit like this happened, what did he say? You have to adapt and conquer, something like that. Some type of, like, because he's in the military, and he's been in it for a long time, and he was just telling me some old survival tactics, tactics type shit. And I was like, yeah, you know, like, he had me survive adapt and conquer and that's exactly what your youtube that's exactly what you're making us content content creators doing adapting to your situation and figuring out ways to conquer you you know you you just you throwing us away man the same people that brought you up now you 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 tearing us down you know what I'm saying? Maybe the big YouTubers, the CNNs, the the late night hosts, the Casey Neistats and 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 Peter McKinnon, McKinnons, all of them, they don't have nothing to worry about. You know what I'm saying? They don't have nothing to worry about. They can pick up the phone and actually call somebody in YouTube directly. Us, us little creators, we don't have that. We get a we 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 get a a warning or a strike on our content. We only got one time to 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 debate it, and then if you guys still don't like it, oh, forget you. We're not gonna pay you for that, or or we're gonna strike your content, and we don't have no way to to fight it. Like if something if something to me and to my subscribers. Don't think that is 
you know, hurtful, vengeful, or anything like that, what can we do? What can we do, man? Crazy. So, yeah, shocking news today uh, via Nick and Carlo uh, channel. They are leaving YouTube. Uh, I don't think it's going to be forever. You know, she says that they're going to still uh, upload minimum content. But if you guys like some, you know, if you guys, the loyalists like myself, of course, I'm going to have to go over to the website and, and you know, continue following them but as far as youtube concern yeah and a lot of and a lot of a lot of uh content creators are leaving youtube now some content creators just doing this membership shit just to try to get over you know what i'm saying well in order to find out about trucking content you gotta pay for it really you don't have to pay over here like I said before, I said it once, I said it again, I said it a million times over. My money is driving this truck. This YouTube is is only a hobby, and I do it for you guys. That's it. You guys want to support the channel? Y'all know how to do it. I, I I say it all the time. Coffee, PayPal, Cash App. Boom. Hit me up, man. Hit me up. I am... Wow, that's that's crazy, man. All right, so next up, next up, 2020. Well, actually, this happened in 2019. Um, this happened in 2019. Well, first, before I get into that, let let me talk about what happened last night, which was New Year's Eve, or new yesterday was New Year's Day. Day before was New Year's Eve, and. A bunch of people got together. They went to this club in Cleveland called Club Medusa, something like that. Uh, let me see. Club Medusa. Uh, it don't even say the club name. I'm thinking it's Club Medusa. But anyway, it anyway, a whole bunch of people went to celebrate the new year. Bring it in. You know, bring it in right. You know, get together, party. Have fun, listen to good music. Unfortunately, tragedy struck, and people just can't have a good time. 13 people, and this is my city, 13 people were shot in a violent nine hour stretch late New Year's Eve, early New Year's Day. 13 people were shot. A 31-year-old woman was killed by uh, by, cele by by a celebratory gunfire, and four people was injured outside of a nightclub, uh, or among 13 that was shot during the nine hours. Now, what I just say a couple of days ago, what goes up comes down, and this pretty much proves my point. A 31-year-old woman got shot by celebratory gunfire. What is the point of you guys shooting on the for I mean uh New Year's Eve for? Why? There was 10 overnight shootings. A 38-year-old man is accused of fatally shooting his living girlfriend while he popped off rounds just after midnight. Let me see. Four people were shot around 1 a.m. at Club Medusa. This is a club. Why we can't just go in there and have some fun? We're shot Why? outside of the Medusa Club in downtown Cleveland. That's yeah, on St. Clair near 13th Street. Street. Now, we don't have any information yet. It's just like right now, for example. You know what I'm saying? You know, you got people walking up and down the street. You got people watching you and all like that. You don't know what's going to happen. You know, and, and it's, it's better to be protected. Better to be safe than sorry, pretty much. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. So be safe, be sorry, be merry, be prosper in 2020. Let's just let's just hope that we can all come together and have some fun without without the bloodshed, without the bullshit. All right, all right, all right. So let's get back. Let's get let's um let's get at this right quick. Let's get let's get at this, man. Let's get at this. 
Fleetwood, another trucking company, y'all. Another trucking company closing. That's crazy. That, <laughs> that is crazy. This company from Texas, Texas, uh, with 260 drivers and owner operators shut down. A year defined by devastation, num I mean, by devastating number of trucking companies closure will end with Fleetwood Transportation sh uh, Services shutting down on the New Year's Eve after more than 60 years in business. Rumblings of the Texas based trucking company begin earlier this month. Let's see. Uh, let's go down here. We regret to inform you that Fleet that Fleetwood companies will cease operations as of December 31st, 2019 at 11:59 p.m. We would like to we would like to have we would like to have given you the you and your employees more notice however it is i mean it has not been until recently that fleetwood transportation services has been able to renew its insurance at that time the premiums for insurance became unaffordable and the decisions was made within the last week to cease operations crazy right crazy say it ain't so man Say it ain't so. Is the bloodbath going to continue in in the 2020? I certainly hope not. You know, I, I, you know, but think of it this way though. I mean, I, I don't want to. I feel sad for the company and for the employees and for the drivers, but kind of feel happy for the rest of us because that's more freight coming our way. Look, the company that I work for, I am very thankful that they take care of us and I hope and pray that that I'm that I'm able to retire from this company and to go into my trilight years happy. You know. We already got uh NF NFI buying out GMP and now we got Fleetwood uh transportation shutting down. So that's it, man. That's it. I think, um, I think, let's see. I think that's about it. I do want to say this quote, though, before I get up out of here. Time is not equal. The older you get, the faster it moves. <laughs> think about that. Think about that. The older you get, the faster time moves. And, of course, you know, time don't wait. For no man Alright So that's it for today Today's podcast For January 2nd 2020 I really do appreciate you guys I hope you guys is enjoying The, the um, me and the queen uh, Meet up video I hope you guys enjoying that Make sure you share it If you like content like this Definitely make sure you subscribe Like, share Hit that notification bell And all that other good stuff that I be asking you guys to do. You guys know how to. Uh, you guys know how to donate to the channel. All of the links is in the description below. And I just want to say one other thing. People, especially kids, especially groups of kids that don't know nobody, it's best not to mess with that person. Because you don't know what that person is packing. You guys have a blessed day. And I will come back at you with another video. Peace.